Yes, this is the um, this is the toilet. And, uh, Leslie will demonstrate the toilet. You sit like this. Uh. Well, thank you very much, Leslie. <laughs> <laughs> we don't wish to be uh, too expressive on that. In the back, a double bed, full size, four foot six by six foot. Two bunks here. With wet and there will be little curtains and little doors on there and uh, Colin's looking <laughs> extremely uh, backpedaling. This is going to be the kitchenette unit. The cooker of course will be raised up to about that height and uh, there will be a gas bottle in the cupboard and uh, underneath the framework of the cooker there will be a little gas fire, what we have purloined. Um, on the back here will be a strip light, a small 12 volt strip light, and uh, 12 volt current comes from this ordinary cigar plug, what I have fitted there. Um, and the actual travelling accommodations here will have a table across the two seats, British Rail fashion, except for this one will run. And uh, that's about it, really. Um, we shall do a little bit more in about a fortnight's time when it's all got carpet in and it all looks good. we have installed a 250 volt socket for campsites abroad. We plug into most campsites on the EEC, which goes to the mains, where the mains appliance is. Now if you'll come round the back, I'll show you what we've done to the boot. The uh, original boot came to about there, and we cut the bodywork right up to that point there and uh, made a new door of aluminium 2x2, hung the original hinges on and put some of the original uh, bits and pieces like the, the um, boot handle itself. But more to the point, we've enlarged it so that we can get our equipment in the back. When you do lift it up, there is a very large space which will be lined, of course, inside. We can get the organ, Leslie, in fact, twice as much equipment as we've already got in that amount of space. And of course, that is the space where the double bed is over, over the boot space itself. So um, we can carry quite a lot of equipment and it's, it'll, it'll be totally secure in here. It'll be padlocked and it'll of course be dry and warm. Well, this is how the original coach work looked paint-wise. We couldn't video it at the time because we didn't have access to uh, video equipment, but uh, this is taken from a photograph. And of course, uh, this is how it looks now. As you can see, a marked improvement. The back windows are painted inside with emulsion paint to give that smoky sort of smoky effect of uh, distinction. Uh, we'll have to excuse the young man in the coach, just, just recently he's been a pain. <laughs>